All right, greetings from Lenawee County in the great state of Michigan. I am the Lenawee Trekker. This is the first official run of the PCX since all her component parts have been changed that needed to be changed. Uh, I'm going to take a real quick run down through some hills and see how she does. I have 10 miles on this tank of gas that I got the other day. And while, yes, I have been riding around locally, I haven't been doing a whole lot of uh, long distance or high speed riding. That's why everybody keeps walking down. There's a dog park down here. Okay. Alright, right off the bat, I can hear a little deeper note from the exhaust. It's not bad, but I also noticed that the popping has stopped since I put the uh, packing in the exhaust. Alright. I've also noticed that it's freaking cold. Well, it said 68 degrees on the uh, thermometer inside the house. I'm thinking that was more of a wishful thinking type of reading. <laughs> yes, it's 55 through here, and I'm doing 50. Well, indicated 50 anyways. Um, because it's kind of my style. If nobody's on my tail, I'm not going to... I hate to say it, but my default speed, my cruising speed is usually about 45 miles an hour. So I'm more than content at 50. Let me bring her up to 55. There we go. Again, I've noticed that the bike has a deeper note from the exhaust. I have the silencer in on the new uh, muffler, so I'm not sure exactly why it's so deep. Unless that's normal for it, which is okay, because it's still it's still pretty quiet, but the little backfiring sounds, they're gone. That was obviously the uh, gasket at the head that was probably leaking oxygen into the, uh, into the muffler and we're getting a little post-detonation type of thing. Okay, hot dog, slow it down, slow it down. Alright, this is a little area right here. It's kind of fun. Oh yes, I do know that you guys on your sport bikes can burn through there a whole lot faster than I can. But you know what? I've already got enough road rash to last me for the rest of my life. So I'm not going to push my luck. Alright, now we got a nice little hill. Let's just hold 45 and see how she does. too too shabby I can live with it all 
All right, what I'm going to do is I'm going to take a loop around through Adrian and then back up 52 to Occidental Highway back home. And um, see if I get any little lights on here or see if she misbehaves for any reason. But so far, she's feeling real good. But like I said, again, she's, she's just uh, warming up right now. So we shall see. All right, the Melosi variator doesn't seem to add anything to the top end of the bike. However, I will tell you one thing. I am not running the Dr. Dr. Sliders. I am running the lightweight um, weights in the variator. And it does seem to accelerate a whole lot better. So I'm happy about that. All right, we made it into Adrian. Bike seems to be behaving as it always used to do. Doesn't seem to be any faster. It seems to have a deeper note on the exhaust when you're at speed. Um, I am pleasantly surprised. I don't want a loud exhaust. I don't like loud exhausts. I might try taking the silencer out for a while and see how she behaves then. But uh, so far, so good. I can't complain. Um, a happy camper. Um, you know, there should be a law that you can't put up two street signs, two street lights like that within a quarter mile of each other. But anyways, back on topic. Uh, yeah, the bike seems to be doing fine. I'm happy with it. It seems to be behaving. No unusual noises. The little popping sounds that I was hearing earlier before I put the uh, gasket in on the head. Yeah, I'm happy. Actually, as usual, I'm hearing more wind noise than I am exhaust note. I can I can hear the exhaust note. A small bike. All right, I don't have a whole lot of battery left on this thing. Uh, so, yeah, we've got it all back up, up back to normal. I've been just playing around over there at the uh, Motorcycle Safety Foundation course over here at Votech and Adrian. Yeah, I, I, I think I think the project, the Challenger project is basically complete for now. Uh, I don't see a need to do a tune-up because it had a tune-up before she went on her last long trip and failed so yeah i'm happy runaway treasure out